Hi, I'm Amelia Tamayo. President Trump has announced that he is preparing an executive order that would invalidate birthright citizenship. This means that children born in the United States to undocumented parents would no longer be American citizens. Hmm. In other news... Benjamin Franklin's Bucket Brigade is one of the most important inventions today. Although now we call it the Fire Department, it still holds many of the same values that it did at its birth. We wanted to learn more about these values and what it takes to become a firefighter, so we came to the Northampton Fire Station to sit down with the fighters themselves. In the city of Northampton right now, the Fire Department is comprised of firefighters who have paramedic certifications. So in order to become a firefighter in Northampton, you must attend paramedic school or be attending paramedic school, you submit a resume to the HR department with all these qualifications and we call people in for interviews. I think one of the biggest challenges that we have today is in fire prevention. It's getting people to change the batteries in their smoke detectors, change the batteries in their carbon monoxide alarms, keep those detectors and alarms up to date and up to code, and um, general housekeeping issues combustibles too close to portable heaters and candles. Candles are very dangerous if left alone so it's very important that they're in some type of container to keep them from falling over and there's no combustibles around that can catch on fire. Well on TV it, it glorifies quite a bit. It shows all of the moments where you know, you get the glory, you're the hero, you're, you're really brave, but it doesn't show like a typical day on the job. And it, really there is no typical day, but it doesn't show, you know, more of the nitty gritty stuff that we do that isn't put on TV. The biggest risks I would say is just letting your guard down in a situation that you shouldn't. Whether it be in a working structure fire, any type of hazardous material, or even on a medical call. One of the more memorable ones was picked up a, a patient at two or three in the morning and uh, he had like something in his pocket, like a, went down to like here and he's like, yeah, I was like, what is that, man? He goes and he pulls a full rack of ribs out of his pocket, like from, I, it was like a full half rack, covered in a pocket and just starts going to town. And I was like, you know what, man, good for you. <laughs> good for you, I'm not gonna take that from you. And he just kept saying, um, these are my meats. <laughs> That's all I kept saying. Thanks for watching. I'm Amelia Tamayo, and this was another news. Bye.